the world's biggest show in lending and fintech, welcomed guests to the Jacob Javits Center last week. The two-day event explored the latest trends in the international financial and technology sectors. We started here with Lendit was um, uh, a chance to, what we thought a chance to bring um, platforms together around the United States to share ideas, share experiences, and grow our industry. Today, as you heard on the main stage this morning, we have over 48 countries represented um, in, in, uh, among the almost 6,000 uh, delegates that are here at Lendit um, today and tomorrow. That's really exciting to us. What's most exciting to me is that we have such a strong partnership with China, that we have, we have so many um, delegates um, from the mainland that are, that are coming here to, again, share ideas with us and, and grow the industry, not just um, in the United States, obviously, but, but globally. Many local and international companies participated in the landed financial event, including Up Financial. The Chinese company held a press conference and unveiled its new business line, along with a report of the state of China's fintech market. Up Financial CEO Yuan Chenglong explains the significance of attending the two-day event. Actually,我们这是来那个Nanit的峰会的话,一方面呢是希望能够在这边找到一些在这个大数据,在这个数据挖掘,在这个人工智能方面比较有经验的一些人才能够去充实我们的这个团队,去发展在中国的这个业务。